Good morning, guys. I hope that you are doing well. My, my name is Abdel Salim Garba. I'm a chartered accountant and influencer on YouTube. I created this YouTube channel to give advice, uh, the most, the best advices uh, I can make to young African people about topics related to young, uh, to entrepreneurship, employment, and personal development. Today, I will share with you um, a quick summary. Uh, in this first part of this video, I will quick I will share with you. Uh, part of the summary of book uh, uh, the four hour week of uh, uh, published by Timothy Ferris Tim Timothy Ferris he wrote this book uh, in 2007 and uh, this book was published uh, in 2 million copies and uh, was uh, ranked uh, in top 10 of uh, uh, New York Times uh, ranking for best sellers book uh, during four years. So this is a great book for guys who want to, to, to live the, the new lifestyle of uh, new rich that uh, Mr. Tim Ferriss uh, is uh, describing uh, the life, the, how they are, they are, they are doing, their, they are living their lifestyle. So um, this book is interesting because uh, he gave us, he is giving uh, good advice to, uh, on, on how to manage our time, how to eliminate uh, some, some constraints in time, a lot of tasks we are doing and which, are, which is not very important and which is taking a lot of time and which, which prevent us to, 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 to do what we want really to do, what we are really passionate about. So, uh, for Tim Ferriss, he said that tra tra traditionally, traditionally or historically, uh, usually the the old rich are going uh, are going to school. After school, they are spend they're spending forty years on work on a job position, and after that, in sixty five or 70 retired so the guys they retired then they go they they are going on retirement at 65 or years old or 70 years old so he said that this is the old rich mindset but the new rich mindset that he is giving for uh, the definition in his book they these guys don't want to exchange 40 years of their life uh, for money or for a job they think that uh, they want to to enjoy the life when they are young man, young people, young rich, young man, and I think that um, and he think that uh, for him it's better to to take time now to to enjoy life with his family to make think of what you are passionate about. Um, otherwise, to extend forty years on work. Uh, in terms of in a job, in the same job or in a position in a work, so his book is not uh, is not for guys. It's not to say to guys that just work four hours and after that go uh, and after that go to sleep. No, for him it's important just to 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 get free time, more free time to make something you are passionate about and to serve other people in the same time you to, 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 to generate cash flow revenue income to, to enjoy your life to enjoy your life. Tim, Mr. Tim Ferris is the make a definition of work in his book. He said that work is activity you are doing to get money, to get cash, uh, in opposite to activity you are doing by vocation because you are passionate about. So he want you make the difference between this the both activity both kind of activities, and he said that uh, the, the 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 goal and the vision of this book, the message he want to share with us again is to increase our productivity work and do and make in four in four hours 
um, what we are currently doing in 40 hours of work or, or job. Once we, you will decrease the work, uh, the time you are spending on work, now in this book he will give you advice and share with you his experience about uh, uh, what you can do with your free now, your free time. Uh, is not uh, is not is not it does not mean that that uh, you are just uh, go and sleep or something like that. It's just find something uh, you will be good at or you will be passionate at about it and spend the rest of time uh, on it. He said that the most important thing for new rich, uh, in opposite to to old rich, is three 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 element. The first one is the time, so the time they want to, 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 to have, to, to, in, to, enjoy, to enjoy with, is the mobility, uh, the second one, so the time, the mobility, and the, second, the third one is, uh, in the same time they are enjoying life, they want to get money, to get cash. So it's not, they don't want to have one million dollars or one million euros in their bank account. It's not important for the, for, for the new rich. What is very important for new rich is time, is get money to, to live the lifestyle of millionaire without being a millionaire, a really millionaire. This is what uh, this, kind, this book wants to teach us. In his book, Mr. Tim Ferriss shared with us four steps to get to work only four hours a week per or four hours per week and to try now to enjoy the life the rest of time. The four step are, steps are the first one is definition and the second one is elimination, the third one is uh, automatic, uh, automating, the, the fourth is get freedom. So for four step, for this four step, in this part of this video, I will share with you the first one, and tomorrow in the second part of this video, I will share with you the the last of the three last uh, steps. For free, for definition, first one, he said that before to to live the life of millionaire without a being a millionaire. Before to live the life you are dreaming of, or you are dreaming on, uh, you need to define what is your dream. If you cannot define it, uh, is that's a really big issue. You need to define what you are dreaming. What is your dream? The thing to know, the, the, um, uh, if you if you want to 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 know it uh, in another man, manner, you will say that. Uh, if you have all the money you, you need now in your bank account, what you will do, what you will do now, what you will make, you will spend your time, your free time, on what you will spend uh, your free time, what you will do with your free time, uh, if you have enough, enough money at this time, what you will do with your free time. This is the question you need to answer in first. For, for him, for Mr. Tim Ferriss, uh, the most important, if you want to have the rich, the new rich lifestyle, is for reminder, time, freedom, and money. If you have, if you you are taking the control of these three three elements, you will be a new rich, and you can enjoy the life, the rest of the rest of your life. So, for example, the point, the, the first point he want to give in, in, in this first step definition, first advice he want to give us is if you want to measure, if you, if you want to assess your, 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 your wealthy you, your, or your fortune, you need to assess in terms of relative income, not in terms of absolute income. If you, what's he, for example, what does it mean? It, it means that if you, if you take two, two guys, one is Paul, another is Pierre. Paul is a great guy whom, who done, who did, uh, who studied at uh, 
uh, at uh, HEC, Paris or Harvard, something like that. And now he, 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 he earns, uh, in terms of income, um, around 100,000 euros per, per month, for example. But he is working 50 hours per week, around uh, 200 hours per month. In the same time, this, the other guy, Pierre, is working uh, for 10 hours, but it is a, he's, a, he's an entrepreneur and his current earnings, uh, his, his current uh, income, monthly income, is amounted to 50,000 euros or dollars. So he said that if you say, if you look at these two guys, one is, is the earning 100,000 per month, another Pierre is earning uh, 50,000. If you analyze the situation, just look a uh, quick look at, you will see that you will think that Paul is more paid than uh, Pierre. But the, he said that this is a big mistake because if you should, you should analyze the time Paul is spending to make these $100,000 and compare to the time Pierre is, uh, is spending to make the $50,000 US dollar. If you see, if you look at the times, you will see that per hour, Paul is earning $25 per hour. And in opposite, Pierre is doing is currently doing $125 per hour because Pierre making is spending less time, but is even if he uh, he is currently gross uh, income is more is less interesting. His he, in terms of really relative income, uh, his situation is better than Paul's situation. And he said that, in addition of that, if we suppose that Paul is living in a country where the inflation rate is higher than the country where Pierre is living, it means that n times uh, uh, Paul will be less paid than, than, than Pierre. So what it is what is important for him in when you want to be a new rich is to analyze the, your current earnings with the time you're spending on. You need to spend less time to, to earn less, more income. This is what he wants to say. Spend less time and make more money. Now, for guys who, want, who, who are afraid to make the, the jump, who are afraid to be an entrepreneur, to make the entrepreneur journey. He said he has a good advice, a good, uh, good uh, practice, a good, uh, a good um, uh, homework he want to give you. The first, uh, first one, you need to take a paper, a sheet of paper and a, and a pen or a pencil and try to answer to these following questions. The first one is, what are you afraid the most of what what is your most fears you need to answer on what you think you can do if your fear hap happened in the situation you are if the fear happened what you can do what for example if you are afraid to to, to make the entrepreneur journey what are you afraid? What uh, what is your fear in this situation, and what you think? Do you think you can do if your fear uh, happened? The third question you can answer is: What do you think you can do to 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 go back on your previous situation? If you are you you make you made the jump of entrepreneur. And now you think that you you are you are failing. You are currently failing. Experience uh, uh, fail. What you can do to go back to find a new job, or in or, or maybe uh, if you don't have a new job, you can partner with some guys, etc. What solution you think that you have to 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 
safe, to be safe of this situa of this situation, which is very catastrophic for you. If you are fired today in your job, what you will do? You need to answer to this question. A another question you need to answer in the in this sheet of paper is: If your project of your or your business work worked or is succeed, what do you think or how money? Uh, what do you think you, you you will you will earn from this experience? What do you think you will win from this experience in terms of money, in terms of experience? What is what will be the good things you think, the good lessons you think that you can you can took, take from this experience? Another question you need to answer: What are you delaying by because of fear? What are you delaying? What tax do you currently delay? because of your fear because he said that if you are you are afraid of something if you are delaying something because of fear it it means that this is the thing you need to do you must to do and you have to do because the best way to 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 fight against our fears is to go is to is to is to do it is to make things we are afraid of is to actions is to make to make actions another question you need to answer you need to answer is what is cost what is the cost for you physically financially emotionally what is the cost for you because of your inactions what do you think that you are losing actually because you are not taking actions he said that these questions if you answer to these questions you will after that read, read the paper and analyze and in 80 percent of case you will see that the most fear you have is not very uh, it is not very uh, bad like you are thinking of you are, you are thinking like your mindset is thinking to you so you will see that the fear is just psychologic psychological thing so you need to to realize that you are losing a lot of more because of inaction than if you are taking action if so the lesson he want you need to retain is you need to take action if you want to be successful in life everything you need to do you, everything in every domain every area of expertise you are you need to take action if you have some fears take action is the best way to succeed so <coughs> this is the first step you need to answer uh, you need to, to retain in this summary and uh, tomorrow I will share with you, with you the third, last, the last three steps uh, uh, from his book. I hope that this message will be useful for you in terms of uh, uh, personal development or in terms of uh, something you are afraid now and you, want, you, are, you are not uh, taking action at this time. And hope that this will be helpful and useful very for you and for your colleague please if you is the case is the case don't hesitate to put me the like please don't sh uh, share with your colleague your friends and uh, some somebody anybody you think that this this video will be useful for him or her so thank you for watching us don't forget please to subscribe and thanking, thanking for thanks all for watching our video. Cheers, take care, and see you tomorrow for the second part of this summary. Cheers.